You know the beginning of this story. This is Longbourn, home of the Bennets. Mr. and Mrs. Bennet have five daughters, Jane, Elizabeth, Mary, Kitty, and Lydia. But their future is uncertain. If Mr. Bennet dies, this guy will inherit Longbourn, leaving Mrs. Bennet and her daughters without a home. So she tries to marry them off to the men who cross their paths, and the richer, the better. Enter Mr. Bingley and Mr. Darcy. But wait, here's where the story changes in a case of some delicacy. Mr. Collins visits first, and immediately likes Jane. At the Meryton Assembly, rumors of an engagement between Jane and Mr. Collins are already spreading. Elizabeth won't let Jane be married off to their cousin. During a picnic hosted at Longbourn, Elizabeth sneaks off to confront her father for allowing the courtship to continue. They have a bitter argument, which is overheard by Mr. Darcy lurking outside the window. Against his better judgment, he offers to help Elizabeth. They begin a series of secret morning meetings to strategize how to foil Mr. Collins' pursuit of Jane. Prejudices begin to crumble as Elizabeth and Mr. Darcy come to know and respect each other. Will they save Jane from sacrificing her happiness for the family's security? Will they fall in love along the way? How will Mrs. Bennet's incessant matchmaking complicate matters? Plenty of surprises await as Austin's beloved cast of characters navigate these altered events in a case of some delicacy. You'll feel like a part of the neighborhood in this warm and funny Pride and Prejudice variation.